a perfect accompaniment with pav or bread this spicy maharashtrian curry is a heart stealer let's get started with spicy kolhapuri misal let's begin by making the misal masala in a pan i'm adding 1 tsp jeera or cumin seeds 1 tbsp salt or fennel seeds 2 tbsp of coriander seeds 2 tbsp of white sesame seeds 6 cloves 2 pods of cardamom and 1 inch of cinnamon stick roast these for 30 seconds on low flame now i'm adding 1/4 cup of dried coconut 1 tbsp of poppy seeds 8 to 10 dried red chilies 9 cloves of garlic and 1 inch of ginger dry roast all this for a couple of minutes now i'm turning off the flame i'm letting the spices cool down before i grind them time to grind our kolapuri misal masala is ready next we are going to cook the matki sprouts in a pan i'm putting to boil 4 cups of water once the water comes to a boil i'm adding 1 and 1/2 cup of sprouted matki or moat beans into this i'm adding 1/2 a teaspoon of turmeric powder and 1 teaspoon of salt cover this and cook for 4 to 5 minutes once the matki has come to a boil turn off the heat let's move on to the gravy now in a heated pan i'm adding 6 tablespoons of oil once the oil is hot add 1 teaspoon jeera half a teaspoon of hing and two finely chopped onions once the onions have turned translucent i'm adding two finely chopped tomatoes add a pinch of salt at this stage and stir continuously cooking this for a few minutes now i'm adding half a teaspoon of turmeric powder 2 tablespoons of kashmiri red chili powder and 5 tablespoons of the misal masala we made stir continuously and cook for 3 minutes now i'm adding 1 and 1/2 tablespoons of salt mix time to add the matki we boiled Let this boil for 5 minutes until the matki is cooked completely and the oil separates from the curry. This is done. For serving, I'm firstly separating the thin spicy oily gravy also called the tari. This is served separately to amp up the spice quotient if needed. Next, I'm pouring the steaming hot misal into the plate. Next goes in the farsan. Garnish with some chopped onions and coriander leaves and you're good to go. Serve this with pav or bread and some onions. Perfect. Enjoy. Until we meet again eat well live well and stay blessed